Welcome back to We've Tried It. I'm Missy, and tonight we're down at Tangled Salon and Spa with co-owner Nan Greco. How are you? I'm great. Thanks for having us. Yay. Okay, we have another question for you, and this time it is about makeup. Okay? All right. Okay, so Chris, or no, I'm sorry, Ange Angela wanted to know, um, she sees different colored concealers, purple, green, yellow. What are they for, and how do I use them? I didn't know that there was different colors myself, but as you can see, I might have forgot to put some on. Well, and if Missy wears makeup, I'm generally the one that puts it on her. So, all right, Angela, thanks for your question. All concealers that are colored serve a purpose. Serve a purpose. Concealer that's green neutralizes red. So someone that has a scar or a blemish using a green concealer would allow that red to minimize and you wouldn't see it anymore. I do recommend that you always use your ring finger when applying concealer as your ring finger has the least amount of muscles in it and allows you to be very gentle around that eye area that has no oil glands in it. It is as thin as paper around there. Yellow concealer allows you to minimize blueness or purpleness under the eye, which is, a, is an excess amount of blood underneath the eye area, which is more or less when we get tired, the blood flows to the bottom of our eye area to nourish it and keep it healthy. So you can put a little bit of yellow concealer on that area to minimize that. Lavender is also a concealer, and those are better suited for concealing bruises. One great trick to do, I would recommend, is to use one to two shades lighter of your foundation color, tap it under your eye area, and that will brighten up your eye and make you look fresh. fresh. Thank you, Dan. Okay, so we actually had more questions, but what we're gonna do is actually have some makeup lessons where she's gonna put makeup on me or Shirley and uh, we'll be videoing that process. So keep watching. Thanks. Thanks, Ann. Thank you. Mm -hmm.